The court of public opinion has rendered a verdict, and the verdict is they all must resign. Meantime, outside City Hall, demonstrators showed unity and condemned the racist remarks. While My thing is, if you are racist and you're getting into something where you know it's a melting pot, What it do, what it do, what it do happen, Jay family? Welcome back to the channel, baby. Yes. <laughs> it's your boy Half. And your girl Jay. And we back with, with another, another reaction, reaction video. video. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Wait, do it one more time. But you're almost there. Okay. I said, okay. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Have a good day. Have a good day. Okay, well. Yeah. Have a great day. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. I, I, just okay. You know, I just not heard what you said. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. So, anyway. Uh, we about to jump and do some more reactions. Hope everybody out there enjoying their day. Yes. Um, I know everybody's been hearing about this because we've seen it. I know y'all have seen it. So we wanted to get on here, react to it, get your guys' uh, input on it, get our input on it, and, uh, you know, just talk about it for a little second. So with that being said, should we jump straight, should we jump straight into it or should we do the intro and everything too? We got to do the intro because we got to send off the good vibes. That's off the good vibes. Yes, we have to send them off. Okay. Well, before we get into it, everybody else out there who has not yet subscribed to the Chizano, yes. go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Yes. Turn your post notifications on. Yes. Like and share this video. Yes. Come from back here, look, watch this. And comment down below, baby. <laughs> down below. <laughs> Come and join the squad, man. Yeah. Happy Jay. Yes. We over here kicking, kicking off. off. What? Good, good vibes, vibes baby. baby. Good vibes. Boom. You oh, okay. Let's get it. Anger, outrage, and chaos at City Hall. The LA City Council in turmoil after racist remarks are made public. Tonight, protesters are calling for the immediate resignation of former Council President Nuri Martinez and two other members as the scandal intensifies. We have live team coverage on the political uproar and the growing fallout. We begin with Mary Beth McDade, live at City Hall tonight. Mary Beth. And Mike and Cher, things are pretty quiet out here tonight, but earlier today it was a whole different story when the cries for these three city council members to resign grew extremely loud, both out here in front of City Hall and inside the chamber. <laughs> Outrage filled a packed Delhi City Council chamber. Two of the four heard on the racist recording showed up for the city council meeting, Gil Cedillo and Kevin DeLeon. <laughs> The disgraced city councilman. Can you imagine the embarrassment? Well, I I'm not for sure, but I'm just saying. The embarrassment that they're probably feeling right now by just sitting in there with all those people in there yelling that stuff to them, how embarrassed that they feel by even um, getting caught doing that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You would think that they're, that they're embarrassed. Right. You know what I'm saying? You would think that they are. But and guess, we, we never said what this was. Right, so you go go ahead and fill me in. Though. Um, we're reacting to their the L A City Council members who um, made racial remarks during one of their meetings. Mm -hmm. uh, it was there were what four mm -hmm. four members, and this just goes to show how racist people get into positions, right. and you know. They flock together right. and have these secret conversations. Well, mm -hmm. they think it's secret because somebody purposely recorded this conversation and leaked it. This reminds me of like one of those movies where, like the movie with Will Smith, when um, he had information on something mm -hmm. and the, the I don't. Oh, the, you talking about um, 
I think was it the city council members were af- or the gov- yeah, government yeah, yeah. was after him yeah. because he knew information. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's one of my thinking it was going actually. to get leaked. Yeah. So this reminds me of a movie like a scan scandalous scandal. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, I hope they sh- show play the recording on here. Right, and see, and, and again, like you said, that it just goes to show that um, there are individuals in this country that's still racist. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Or that may think racist stuff. Right. You know what I'm saying? And uh once again you have to research who you who you're voting for, who you're putting in power. Well you know people But people you don't know that's why I was just about to say that. You don't really know and I, and I said this before in a video, like you don't really know a person. You don't. You know what I'm saying? Like you, you know you, you don't you don't know. So that's why I have never gotten into the Republican the Democrat thing. Because mm-hmm. You don't know who this person is. Right. They can just be put on this persona just to get into. But office. eventually, their will come real out. face, it will come out. their real true person will show. Right. And it happens every time. Right. So you can put on this front, and but you're going to be revealed every single time. Yep. Every time. It, yep. it never fails and it's not going to pass anyone. Yep. That's why you got to stay true to who you are and, and really stand on what you believe in because... Your true colors are going to eventually show. Facts. No matter what you, no matter how hard you, hard you try to hide it. Facts. So, let's go. But the four heard on the racist recording showed up for the city council meeting. Gil Cedillo and Kevin DeLeon. The disgraced city councilman finally left, basically forced out by the angry crowd. The crowd finally quieted when an emotional councilman, Mike Bonin, spoke. I am reeling from the revelations of what these people said. Councilwoman Nuri Martinez can be heard criticizing Bonin's adopted black son, calling him a little monkey in Spanish. And then there's this this white guy with this little black kid who's misbehaved. He is bouncing off the effing walls on the floor, practically tipping it over. There's nothing you can do to control him. You hear the people in the background laughing and stuff. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Who's misbehaved? He is bouncing off the effing walls on the floor, practically tipping it over. There's nothing you can do to control him. Why is it on people? These people stabbed us and shot us and, and cut the spirit of Los Angeles. Then it was the public's turn to speak. And I condemn her for her words because she has laid a nuclear bomb here that we will not allow to divide us. The reason this is a hard meeting to conduct is because we heard an hour of some of the most hateful things the city has ever heard from three, four people in some of the most powerful positions in Los Angeles. People are hurting. Acting City Council President Mitch O'Farrell agreed his colleagues must go. The court of public opinion has rendered a verdict and the verdict is they all must resign. Meantime, outside City Hall. Demonstrators showed unity and condemned the racist remarks. While co- My thing is, if you are racist and you're getting into something where you know it's a melting pot of different ethnic backgrounds, why even get into it? Like, why? Why? I, I just... So they can have control. Have, con- have control, That's but you can't... But you can't... Control. You want control, but you're not going to have control over everything you know what i'm saying true but they can make a lot of decisions and, and, yeah you know what i'm saying and because trust and believe me they're not the only ones oh you know what i'm saying that's not. in this same counselor thing right there's other ones in there they just haven't got caught yet got exposed yet, yeah you feel me so you know and it's scary though when you think of it because you know like i said my brain gets to thinking man i start thinking about you know, judges and, and, mm-hmm. and, and, and DAs and, you know what I'm saying? People who's actually got the power to put you away for life. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's the scary part, though, you know? And it's sad because you can't weed them out until something like this happens. And it's, I know, an unfortunate incident happened with my brother. <clears throat> I remember he went to court for a friend. Mm-hmm. He went just to show support. And he got onto an elevator and there was a, he was an off-duty officer Mm -hmm. and he 
he personally well he not personally knew mm -hmm. my brother but he 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 knows my brother and his group of friends mm -hmm. and he was he told my brother he said i'm sorry for what i'm about to do mm -hmm. and my brother was looking very confused like what is he talking about mm -hmm. and you guys like a few months down the line my brother was um he was uh charged for a crime that he did not commit uh it was a whole setup i don't even want to go into detail what it was but my brother was later freed but he was in he was in there for about a good in jail for about a good six months to almost a year mm. and um the the person oh it's a whole it was a whole a whole scandal but my brother is out thank god and he's doing very very well for himself so yeah, it's it's so many corrupt people that have these high positions, and right. it is scary. Right, and, and got personal scary. vendettas. Oh yeah, against you. and that's you know and saying? that's what he had against right. my brother and one of his friends. Right. So. Right. Right. So. Yeah. It's unfortunate. Demonstrators showed unity and condemned the racist remarks while calling for the city council members to resign. We cannot have representatives who are racist. Racists do not represent our communities, so we need immediate resignations. Martinez didn't attend Tuesday's meeting, saying not. she's taking a leave of absence. She has. Of course, she didn't attend. She, right. was, she was too embarrassed to. Right. You of feel me? Too ashamed. Right. But you wasn't ashamed when you was talking about this no, kid. Because she had. She felt comfortable right. with all the people who feel the same, the same as she way. does. Exactly. So. Exactly. Yeah. Yep. We're racist. Racists do not represent our communities, so we need immediate resignations. Martinez didn't attend Tuesday's meeting, saying she's taking a leave of absence. She has stepped down as city council president, but hasn't given up her seat. Neither have De Leon or Cedillo. The only one to resign is the fourth person involved in the disturbing discussion, labor leader Ron Herrera. They have never been representing our communities. People, that's why we feel that it's very strongly that we need to start voting around values and not around identity politics. Right. Well, President Joe Biden has joined the very long list of people calling on these three city council members to resign. Now, the city council does not have the power to force them to do so, but they did file a motion today to censure them. For now, reporting live here at City Hall, Mary Beth McDade will send it back to you guys in this. Why don't they have the power to force them out after something like that? I don't know. They need to, they need to, that's the, they need to redo that law. Right. They should have it to where if something like that happens they should be able to force them and not only did she make racist remarks she was talking about beating right the son right and he, about the child, the child yeah. was only three years old talking right. about taking him around the corner with her for for Two however long right. like she was gonna you know it had it, it, it makes me really upset it makes me highly upset because mm -hmm. You're in a high position, and you're talking yeah. about a three-year-old child, lady. Like, right? And not only did she make remarks about the child, she were she was speaking on um, was it Asian people mm -hmm. and Hispanics, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And here it is: this man adopted this child, though. Like, he's doing good for, right. the, for the world. Like, you know, but what I'm you know what? That's why she was exposed. That's right. why it came out because right. you just don't. Do hateful things and think you're gonna get away with it. Right. You can go. It can. It can have. You're gonna get exposed no matter. Yeah. How long it takes, it's gonna come out. Yeah. So. Yeah. Be true to who you are. Right. At the end of the day. Right. So you know, and again, and I got, I got to keep reiterating this. It's, it's scary to know that we have people like this in power. Oh yeah. That's that thinks these racist things that they think that they say, you know, and then it's. A group of them mm -hmm. you know what I mean that's the scary part to me mm -hmm. you know um, I'm sure a lot of you guys probably feel the same way uh, if you live out in the LA County city and you attended this uh, little city council meeting comment down below let us know you know let us know what your thoughts are about these uh, council members um, who well actually one particular which is uh, what's her name um, uh... 
I forget. I, forget, her name. I forgot, yeah, yeah. I forget her name, but whatever her name is. So, y'all let us know what y'all think about it. Comment down below. Let us know what y'all think. Um, and do you guys know anything about your council members in your city? Right. And state. Right. Right. Because this is in L.A. We're we don't live in L.A., but this was on the news in in our state. So. Right. I'm sure a lot of people have heard about this. One. Right. Oh, and Joe Biden is in L.A. for I believe two days yeah. because of this incident so right. let's see what the outcome is what will turn out to be right. if they let them all go right right we'll, we'll see yeah we'll see so we'll jump into some shout outs though okay first shout out goes to james davis what's up james davis james davis shout out to you hope you definitely enjoyed that reaction uh, let us know what your thoughts are mm -hmm. you know about these counselors with these racist um offensive marks so let us know comment down below yeah and second shout out goes to and this is my i have a hoodie with this person right. on it uh, yes yeah. uh Richie Rich. What's up, Richie Rich? I love it. Right. Richie Rich, shout out to you. Hope you definitely enjoyed that reaction. Uh let us know what your thoughts are about these council members. Yes. Uh, with these racist remarks. Um Yeah. Yeah, let us know how y'all feel. Like, how would you feel someone talking about beating your child and calling them, like, just a, a racist name? Like, how right. how would you guys feel? Right. Yeah, you leave your comments. Leave your comments. Yes. All right, so it's been fun, y'all. We love y'all. Make yes, sure y'all go do. out your way. To have yourself a wonderful, fantastic, gorgeous, beautiful day. And we'll catch y'all in the next reaction video, baby. Yes. <laughs> Peace. Peace. You know. <laughs>